Good night for baseball in Atlanta, 74 degrees, and the first pitch is rocketed out towards right. Well hit, and right on cue, a home run for Josh Hatcher. How do you like that? Roddy just talked about his home run power, and he displays it with a punctuation point as it's one to nothing, Kennesaw State. Haven't even had a chance to take a sip of water from our open. It's a fastball on the inner half. And Hatcher just turns on. That's exactly what Ryan Cole told us. He said, look, he's a guy that sprays it all over the yard. Maybe the preseason All-Atlantic Sun player. He hits this one well to left with the wind swirling around. It goes off the top of the wall. Bouncing around, he takes the wide turn, and he'll scamper to third with a stand-up triple. How do you like that? A home run and a triple. This one is ripped to right center. Colin Hall played out there, but an RBI single for Donovan Cash in 19 games. And sprayed to third, but it's caught by Drew Compton for the final out. The average age of those who eat little bites is about six. That one is ripped to left. That's the 200th career hit for Tyler Simon as he scampers to second for a double. So now a triple and a double on the hard part for the cycle. Tyler Simon, 200 career hits. He joins an exclusive club of eight players in Kennesaw State history. Congratulations to Tyler Simon. Pretty, it is impressive. Zach Corbin puts the bunt down. They play small ball. Good play by Bart Nicky for the out. But the sacrifice by their at Kennesaw State. And that gets by Rubenstein, and there's a run. Tyler Simon doing it all after the sacrifice by Corbin. Scores the third run of the game for the Owls. His first home run of the season on Saturday. Chopped up the middle and threw for a base hit. His second hit of the game also has a RBI. Good play at third by Compton. But the throw is off the line. And there goes Cash to third. So the struggles continue for the Jackets. Racked out 16 hits. And the bunt put down by Edson. Beautifully, the flip by Jenkins, no good. As the Magic continues this inning for the Owls. Ball gets away. Run across in two runs, and the runner going to third. And he's in there on a sacrifice. And this is hit in left center. That will play the sixth run of the game. And an RBI for Hudson Mims. Was his fifth RBI of the season. They are ripping early. The technology. Pretty well hit. Colin Hall back to the track. Looks up. Colin Hall says it's gone. Home run. He hesitated, but Mason Jones has the home run. His second of the year. Looked like Hall had a good chance, but. Yeah, right. But uh, Danny Hall a little upset. And that will end the inning. What a walk. Hitting over 400. Chopper boxed around by Stills, but he got the runner for the force as Rubenstein advances to second on the fielder's choice. First pitch hunting, and it gets by the third baseman, Cash Young. Runner Rubenstein being waved home. Throw is cut off, and there's the first run of the game for the Jackets. Jenkins says, I don't care about that. I'm hitting. And Parada in the third. Some Georgia Tech with some thunder in the third. Against McKenzie Stills. Q shot to short. Tough play. And he's in there for an infield single. Tyler Simon late on the throw. There's a run by Parada, and it's 8-2. Chopped up the middle, good play by Simon. Throws to first for the out. Well done by Tyler Simon, Rangy at shortstop. 
Right off the bat to left center and in there. Gonna be extra bases. Inning starts with a bang for Kennesaw. Good slider, can mix in a cutter as well. And just like that, two pitches and two hits. Zach Corbin to right. Wide turn by Simon, but he's back at third after the throw in by Stephen Reed. And they're back in business, Kennesaw State. <laughs> I've seen a lot of Georgia Tech games over the years. Good play on the backhand by John Anderson. The throw to first, but the runner scores. Simon comes in for the ninth run of the game for Kennesaw State. Edson with a bunch single, his last at bat. Pops it up. Gonzalez towards the line, and he makes the catch to end the inning. A run for the Owl. Past the dive of the third baseman. Cash Young for the hit. Holler. And he hits him. Looks like he is. Including last night when they had 13. Rangy play by the second baseman over to Simon. Does not complete the double play. And that brings in the third run for Georgia Tech. And it's chopped to Hudson Mims for the third out of the inning. Four doubles in the game. Five for five. He's a hit machine. That's his second hit of the game. He hit a leadoff home run on the first pitch he saw from Luke Bartnicki. Yeah, good observation about still playing a bit of a pitcher, and Corbin laces one to the gap. Simon will score easily. Corbin is second for the double. Kennesaw State is in double figures with their 10th run. Look at third, but a high throw gets away from Tim Borden over the first baseman. Jenkins throw home, not in time. Sloppiness continues for the Jackets, and it's 11 to 3, Kennesaw State. Look at the runner, Cash. And he got him swinging. Cameron Hill comes in, gets the strikeout. Runner left at second. Three pitches. Jack Rubenstein instead extends the inning. You are correct, Roddy Jones. Excellent at bat for Rubenstein, who has his first hit of the game. Feet last night. That goes over the head of Gonzalez. As Jess misses outside. Good take by Parada. And the bases are jammed. What do I know? Grounded into left field for a base hit. Told you you should have stayed away from the fastball. <laughs> Two runs across, and it's 11 to 5 as Andrew Jenkins delivers. And he got him swinging. Well done by Luke Torbert out of the bullpen. Here's Mason Jones. Fly ball. Give it a ride to right field, and another home run by Mason Jones. Two strikes, and he goes yard. Mason Jones, and he steps, he makes sure that he steps on the plate this time. The day off for rest, he caught four straight games, and he goes yard twice as Josh Hatcher lines one out to right center field. Hatcher will easily cruise in for a double. He's going to try for three. Slides in safely, and once again, the extra base hits just piling up for Kennesaw State. <laughs> oh, my. Two home runs for Mason Jones, huh? Yes, sir. And a pop-up by Tyler Simon, a rare outstanding ACC baseball on ACC Network. Well hit to deep center field, back and gone. Home run, Colin Hall, touch them all. His fourth of the season. And the offensive fireworks continue in the last couple innings. Both teams bringing the heat offensively. See Colin Hall as he goes down the third baseline. So when Mason Jones hit the home run, as this one goes down the line, fair ball. 
Gorky bounce out there for Zach Corbin to the left field and a stand-up double for Borden, his second hit of the game. You, <laughs> yeah, you'll, you'll just lose. You, you, can't, you can't disrupt Roddy. Pretty well hit again. And this one is gone. Are you kidding me? The wind takes it out of the yard. And it's a four-run game. Steven Reed. It kept going, going, and gone. Incredible. Decorated players. Backhand by Simon. High throw. And off the bag goes Donovan Cash. Caught up with him. Certainly, yeah. Maybe, maybe not his dad when he first just, uh, first debuted in the uh, mid '90s. <laughs> no, his dad. Later years, like it does to all of us, gravity comes into effect. Absolutely. Excuse me, if you're uh, Benson, you cannot walk him. This one's pretty well hit. Taking off in the jet stream, and it's a goner. A three-run homer for Tim Borden, and we have a one-run game. Simply amazing. 12 to 11, Kennesaw State. The comeback continues by the Jackets. Five days. And a four pitch walk. Rips it to left. And it's dropped by Trez Gonzalez. Gonzalez picks it up, throwing in. Runner. Coming home to score. Insurance run. Nick Kalina crossing home plate. And Josh Hatcher with a double. Should be the cycle if they give him a double, which I believe they will. Yeah, it looks like they have. Josh Hatcher comes to Georgia Tech and hits for the cycle. Chopper, tough play for Brown, but he barehands it, throws it off the line. Here comes another run and more insurance for Kennesaw State as Josh Hatcher crosses on the infield single. Tyler Simon. Just missed outside. Did it hit him? Yes, it did. And the bases are loaded. Young. Corralled it short by Borden for the putout. Gives this one a ride. Deep right center, and it is gone. Just what you think. It might be over. It isn't. Tres Gonzalez is second homer of the year. They still remain kicking in Atlanta. The Jackets, that's four homers from four different players. Parada rips it to left as he keeps it going. Parada has four hits. He gets out of bed and he has four hits. First pitch swinging deep to center. Back, 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 and caught. Oh boy, put some charge into it, but Hatcher fittingly makes the final out of the game with a put out.